it kind of was a, a, a single accident, um, walking a huge black Labrador. Um, saw a squirrel, went one way, I kind of went the other, and I, I felt it go. You know, and I, my knees had bothered me a little bit, but anyways, um, had orthoscopic surgery back east um, very unsuccessfully and was told that I needed a total knee replacement. And I just, I don't know, there was something in me that just didn't buy that. So um, saw three different orthopedic surgeons. All of them were like, yep, total knee replacement. Um, took some x-rays, never took an MRI or anything like that. And again, I just was like, I kept telling my husband, it's, it's, this doesn't feel right. And I found Dr. Stone actually through TED, through the TED talk that he did. And I saw him and I mean, it was just like, that's who I want, that's, that's who I want to see. You know, one of the first things he asked me was, well, let's take a look at your MRI. And I'm like, I don't have an MRI. And he's like, you told me you saw other orthopedic surgeons. And I'm like, I did. And he said, they never pulled an MRI. I'm like, nope. And he's like, how could they tell what the damage was in your knee without that? It was pretty amazing. I was so, he, they did an MRI when I was here. And, um, and the reason I was really interested in Dr. Stone was because in the TED talk, he talks about the meniscus replacement and the, you know, really cutting edge stuff. After meeting with him, he said, Drew, you know, unfortunately, I think you're a little too far gone for that. I don't think you'd have as much success um, with that as you would with this part, with the partial. Um, he said, it's kind of unusual because we usually do them on the, I guess, inside, and this was on the outside. So, but he said, now with this, this Mako computer, it's really accurate. I really, you know, I really feel like we can make this work. And so um, that was, I think, early January, and three weeks later, I came out here for the surgery. After being to all these other doctor's offices and stuff like that, I got to say, the staff here, was, was, from the get-go, made me feel, like, really at home, between Hope and Kelly and everybody. It was just, you know, it was it just worked and I was like this is the place that I want this surgery done didn't have to go into a hospital for three days anything like that in and out and you know I had my ups and downs with a uh, with physical therapy I worked with Trish for uh, you know while I was here um, and then had a physical therapist line back up at home and everything like that and I would go like you know three or four weeks I'd hit a plateau and then I would kind of get a little frustrated and I was like why is it and but she but everybody was like just calm down you know it takes a while but by my three months, when I came back out here, three or four months checkup with him, I was like thrilled. I mean, it was, I was climbing the hills in San Francisco and doing everything. And it was, it was really, it was, it was a really great experience. Everybody's getting knee replacements. And I think Stone's approach is very different. It's like, his attitude is keep your original equipment as long as you can. And, you know, there's a lot of other things you can do besides having your, a total knee replacement. And, um, you know, I think with the research that, that the Stone Clinic does and everything, I mean, because I, I get his newsletter every week and, and I read through it and stuff like that, it's, it's pretty amazing. And I think people need to, you need, you know, you need to uh, question somebody when they tell you what, you know, that you, you need a total knee replacement. When I came in here, not only was the, did I have a torn meniscus, but my, the, the, when I had that orth, the first orthoscopic surgery, my knee was so crooked. It was like, it was, it was, I had to wear, I wore like, baggy yoga pants for six months. I couldn't get anything on over my knee. And my knee was kind of all bent in. And so when he went in and, and did the surgery, he really straightened the leg out too as well. So, I, you know, been thrilled with him. Tell everybody, you know, um, I think that it's a great, what he does is great.